this clown over on there. <laughs> Control is that. Will cash go away though? Uh, they're trying to make cash go away. Control is that for sure. For sure. Remember, Sunny, uh, Sunny Jack, thank you very much for the follow. Uh, remember, uh, Controller Zen, one of the first things that happened when they rolled out this COVID freakout, right? Lock everybody down. There, are, there were places that you couldn't spend cash. And I only spent cash. So I went to places to buy things with cash and they wouldn't take my money. I went to the counter and they said this much and I brought out cash to pay it. And they said, no, no, we don't take cash. It's dirty. There's COVID on it because they were watching fucking bullshit propaganda. There's COVID on the money. Ah, help me, manager. This person's trying to give me cash. We don't take cash. I was like, dude, this is legal tender. You have to take it. We don't take it, right? There was one store here. Okay. It was sort of a... Uh, it was a big store. It had a lot of. Uh, it had. Um, it, it wasn't a. What do you call it? It wasn't like a Home Depot, but it had stuff like Home Depot and lots of other things. It had been here for like a hundred years, right? It downtown Victoria, right? They're out of business. There are places that could that wouldn't take my cash that I didn't go to anymore, right? Some of those places are out of business. They refuse to take money because they watch corporate propaganda, right? Centralized propaganda and refuse to do business with local people, right? Too bad for them because they were low IQ people, okay? They're trying to eliminate cash, right? And there's no doubt about it, right? Because they want to they wanna be able to tax you up the yin-yang right so for example take, take a look let's assume i i i buy this cup brand new right i pay tax on it okay and by the way i got this as a gift from a student a long time student i had awesome gift she sent it to me right awesome it's got a little partner too right but let's assume i bought this as a gift and she bought it at a at a local place crafts people pay Pretty sure, oh no, maybe she didn't pay cash, but either way, it was a local buy, right? So she sent this to me, but let's say I buy this, right? And I pay tax on it, right? Buy it brand new, pay tax on it, drink my tea. Let's assume in the future I want to sell it, right? If I open up a, put it on, uh, do a garage sale or put it on online to sell, right? At a local online website, Someone comes and pays me cash and they can have my cup. Now, I'm not going to sell it at the price I bought it for, right? Because it's used, right? The, go the reason government wants to eliminate cash is this. Because the next time, if I try to sell this and if there's no cash, like look at eBay, right? I have to sell this using digital currency. And when I sell this, the government's gonna want their tax money off this right so if i bought this let's say let's say a hundred dollars we did a we did a asmr math video on this by the way right if i bought this for a hundred dollars and i paid a certain amount of tax let's say in canada would be 15 percent, right so it would have cost me 115 dollars to make it simple let's say 85 dollars and then 15 dollars it would be 87 and whatever 13 but you get the gist and then next time I go sell it, the government's want to, going to want to tax, get their tax money, right? So if I sell it for 50, then there's going to be 750 tax on it. Oh, government takes tax. And then that person, let's say, sells it. That person sells it. That person sells it. That person sells it. By the time this changes hands a few times, you've paid more tax on buying this thing and selling this thing, right? Then the original value of this thing, right? That's why the government wants everything to go digital, because you're going to be paying tax up the fucking yin yang, right? Up the yin yang, right? Because they want their money. Why? In Canada, they just approved four hundred million dollar purchase of a missile system from a U.S. defense company 
that's basically laundering money through Wall Street to send to Ukraine for fuck's sake. Four hundred million dollars. You should check out Canada. Right. You should check out Canada. Complete collapse. Complete collapse.